Hey, so, um, I just finished recording that last video. Well, not just finished. That was, like, an hour ago, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> or a little more. Um, but, hold on. But, um, so I haven't done anything in the world except from coming back home. Um... But after making that, I don't, I guess just making that video and like kind of talking just kind of put me in a better mood. I don't feel as horrible as I did earlier because all day, um, besides when I started recording, I was kind of like crying all day, um, cause I'm sad in many ways than just me being sad. Like I'm, I'm a little pathetic sometimes. You know, but like, <sighs> you gotta own it, you know? Um, let's see how many books I can make this time. Oh, wait, I need to make paper. Um, I'll use this for paper. And then, watch, let me do that. That's good. And then let's see how many books I can make. I can make 20. Okay. Um, I'll do like. Actually, I'll just do all of them. Because that's all I. Yeah. Um, now let's see if I can make some bookshelves. Let's see if I can make those right now. I can make four. I can make more though. If I get some wood, maybe. Uh, let's just stick with these four. Mm. I don't remember how to do the enchanting table because is it one block away or is it let me look at a picture real quick let me google it let me look on google let's see let's look at a picture Okay. Um, so it's just gotta be one block away. So it's not anything that I wasn't doing. I just had to put some more real quick. Um, I think like that is probably good. And I just need these two more. So I can make two more, I think. Um, but I don't have any wood. Okay. Um, <laughs> someone just commented neither so I'm guessing they don't have any friends either <laughs> you know maybe this that video will help some people who don't have any friends know that it's okay to not have any friends you know there's others there's other ones of us that don't have any friends so it's okay you know But aside from that, I didn't want to make another sad video. Um, so, today, well, for this video, I kind of just wanted to um, just kind of. Okay, so I wanted to talk about music. Um, because. There we go. There we go. Okay, I still have three books. Let me get some lapis and then I can start doing some enchantments. Um, just see what I can get. Um, so, currently, my favorite band right now, um, I would have to say, is Plum Tree. Um, I really like Plum Tree a lot. Um, there's this older 90s indie rock band. Um, now, depending on what kind of audience I have here, um, you guys might know who Plumtree is. Um, if. Okay, so I started really listening to Plumtree 
a couple months ago, before, okay, like, I will get to this in a bit, but before the Scott Pilgrim movie came out, I mean, the Scott Pilgrim anime came out, so I'm not a bandwagoner, okay? I ain't like that, but, um, <laughs> they were a good band, so I like them. Um, <gasps> Loyalty? Well, I don't even have it. Oh, but my partner does have a trident. So, hmm. I have 34 levels, but I don't know if I want to use so many right now. No, I won't. Um, I'll just do... I'll just do this one, because it's the cheapest. Unbreaking 2. Oh wait, it's three enchantment. I'm stupid. I should have just gotten it. I forgot that's how it works. I'm literally like the stupidest. I could get respiration. Um, I'm not really good at uh, level uh, enchantments. Ooh, good sharpness. Someone just said same. Is that my friend? I think because. Oh yeah, it is. Aw, I miss them. They, we, we, um, we used to be, like, best friends. Um, I, I still consider them a friend, you know, I still care about them a lot, but we just don't talk as much anymore. Um, and I do miss them, you know. If you're watching this, I, <laughs> um, it's a little embarrassing, I just realized you might watch it, because, you know. <clears throat> but, okay, so Plum Tree. They're a good band, right? But they have a connection to Scott Pilgrim because, for one, the writer of the um, the writer of the comics pretty much based Scott Pilgrim off the song Scott Pilgrim by Plum Tree. So obviously, it has a very strong connection to it already. And to Scott Pilgrim wears a Plum Tree shirt in the show in the movie. And in the comics. So it's connected that way too. But so I when I listened to them, it was before the anime came out, right? And they only had like what like um like sixty K listeners at the time. Um and I was like, Oh, I, I, I expected them to have more because of their connection with Scott Pilgrim and stuff, right? But it was pretty low, and Scott Pilgrim is such like a big, like such a big. I wouldn't say franchise because it's a it's such a big like name, for, especially right now. Scott Pilgrim has been going up and up recently. But oh, I should kill some cows then if I want some more stuff. But the thing is. Once the anime came out, the Plum Tree listeners went straight up. I think I peaked at like 300-ish. Um, and like, I was like, wow, that's crazy. I was a little mad because I was like, these people are fake fans. They don't listen to Plum Tree at all. You know, they just, they just listen to it because they probably just listened to Scott Pilgrim, the song, and um, Go. Um, cause those two songs were in the movie, but, and they probably just like listen to like the movie soundtrack, whatever. And I was a little offended, you know, as a real Plum Tree fan. Okay. It's kind of crazy cause I haven't been this obsessed with like an artist or a band or whatever since Soda Boy. And for those who know me know, I really love Soda Boy. Um, you know, I've talked about him a couple times on this channel. Um, I've covered some songs of him, his on this channel. Most of them are all, I mean, they're all um, privated now. <clears throat> but you see where I'm, but like, yeah, I've been not obsessed, you know. I haven't been obsessed, but. 
um, I've been listening to him a lot. Not right now. Um, kind of just been not listening to much music right now. Been not in much of a mood to listen to music recently. Um, which is strange. Um, so if you don't know, I have autism. If you can clearly tell already. And so, um, my special interest is music and like playing music and listening to music and all that stuff and so i have a very strong connection with music and so if i'm not if i don't want to listen to music and i'm not in the mood that means something's up you know but um i really like plum tree um i've only been listening to them for like um, almost two months and they're at almost two thousand minutes listened um, which isn't crazy, crazy, because people probably listen to music, but I've only been listening to them for the last couple weeks, you know, so it's like, yeah, so I like them a lot, um, but it's just kind of sad, because now that all, like, the hype of the anime is coming down, you know, let's check it, let's, let's open up Spotify, um, go to Plum Tree. There are 182k listeners. That's crazy. You know, that's like a crazy dip. Um, it's a little sad. They deserve a lot. They deserve much more. Um, love, I guess. What? How did I get up here? Oh, that's weird. Okay. Anyways, sorry. Um, but yeah, I really like Palm Tree. Um, it just makes me, I was a little mad cause I was like, um, my partner will know cause I was talking to them the entire time. I was like, oh, I'm so mad. Everyone's listening to Plum Tree right now, but no one cares about them. No one really listens to them. Like I do. I'm a real Plum Tree fan. I wasn't gatekeeping cause I don't like gatekeeping. I like it when artists I like get more, um, recognition and um more listeners because i want them to succeed i want them to like make more music you know but with this it's like people don't really care about the music it's just because of scott pilgrim and like the scott pilgrim song itself is a really good song but no one is going out to listen to more than just the scott pilgrim song they're just listening to the scott pilgrim song it's like wow that's a little stupid isn't it um yeah, so I'm just ranting about that. Um, I really like music. I don't make it. I try not to just make. I try not to make music my entire personality, like people on the internet love to do. Um, but it is a big part of my personality. Not my entire. Per this is a large part of my personality because music is very important to me. I mean, it helps me a lot. Um, I like making music. I like writing music. Um, and so, yeah, that's that. Right now. So, aside from Plum Tree, earlier today, I was listening to Kanye. Because Kanye is my second most listened to artist. Um... So the thing with me is I don't listen to music only on Spotify. I listen to music a lot on YouTube. Um, and I like watching live shows and music videos and stuff like that. I honestly prefer it a little more than just streaming music. I like watching it. Um, and... So, <coughs> with Kanye, I can read out some of the amount of minutes I have with artists. Um, oh, oops. I opened Spotify instead of the thing I use normally. But, um...
So, my top artist is obviously Still the Boy 64 with 10,319 minutes, um, which is about 171 hours and 7 days total. Um, and 4,553 streams. Um, my second most listened to artist is Kanye West. Um, 900 and, I mean 9,617 minutes streamed, um, which is about 160 hours and six days. <clears throat> My third is The Smiths with 6,857 minutes, um, 114 hours and four days. Um, I don't really listen to the Smiths anymore. I used to be a big Smiths fan in um, like my junior year um, of school. Um, I just, I don't know, I just don't listen to them anymore. Not much, there's not really a reason why I don't. I just don't. <coughs> um, I mean, listen to them. Um, it's not much of a reason, I just don't, so... Alright, let's see what else I can get from the enchantment table. <gasps> Power 3. Okay. I'll take that. Sharpness 2. I'll get loyalty. Then I'll give it to my partner next time you're in the game. So yeah, I don't really listen to the Smiths anymore, honestly. But yeah. Um... My, I do listen to them sometimes when I'm like, oh, you know, like in that fall mood, you know, or in that winter mood, just like it's a rainy day and you're, I don't leave, my, but I don't leave my house anymore. So like, it doesn't really do anything, but you know, it's that kind of vibe. Um, but it's been a while since I've like really listened to them. Um, my fourth is this guy called Andy Minio with 6,855 minutes. Um, I don't really listen to them anymore at all really um only sometimes when i'm feeling a little nostalgic you know sometimes i want to go back and be like oh i used to i used to love this um he's a christian a rap artist um when i was younger i only listened to christian music because you know i grew up christian and religious and i thought if i listened to anything else i was gonna go to hell and that my mom was gonna beat me um which wasn't true. My mom didn't beat me. Um, but you know, honestly, he's not even like bad. It's just like kind of corny, cause you know, it's just it's a little corny. You you get it, like just a little bit. But um, aside from that, it's like I just don't listen to. Me. It's just not my kind of music. You know. When I was younger, it was, like, the only thing I could really listen to. It was the only thing that was, like, actually, like... Because it's good, you know? I don't... I'm not saying he's bad. I do... Did enjoy his music a lot. It's just not my kind of music anymore. Um... So, that's my number four. Um... Just give me a second. I need to... I want to plant some... Actually, not right now. It's nighttime. Um, my number five is Mike Kroll, um, with 6,041 minutes. <gasps> There's a zombie big man. Go, 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 go. No, 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 don't send me to another. I don't want to go there another. I just wanted him to stay here. Yay. Let me tell you something. He's my new best friend. Um, his name is, um, Gregory, like from FNAF. Um, anyways, so Mike Kroll, great artist. I love Mike Kroll. Um, I guess, how do I explain what genre is Mike Kroll? I don't really know. Um, indie Garage Rock, I guess, yeah. Um, you know, he's just so good. He's a great artist. I love Mike Kroll. Great music, great sound, great everything. Um, don't listen to him as much anymore. I used to be listening to him a lot in like 2023, 2022-ish. Um, 
I go back to him a lot. So there'll probably be a little phase again where I'm listening to him. Um, but yeah. Um, so 6,000 minutes, 100 hours in four days. Um, then number six is the strokes with 5,402, I mean 5,000, 5,452 minutes. Um, okay, stay tuned now. Um, everyone knows the strokes. I mean, most people know them, you know, um, indie rock, garage rock revival band, you know, everyone, everyone knows and likes the strokes. I don't think there's many people who like dislike them. They're a good band. Like, they're a solid, good band. I like them, you know, um, it's just strokes, um. 90 hours and three total days. Um, let's see. I'm just gonna fill this whole area with it. So that's my top six right now. Number seven is Jack Stalber. Everyone knows Jack Stalber. I don't listen to Jack Stalber anymore at all. Um, but he has 4,000 minutes. Listen to him a lot. My freshman year. Um, so that's where that came from. Where, when did we get this? Was that always there? I don't know. Um, it's not my kind of music anymore at all. I don't like that kind of sound anymore. Um, so I don't really listen to him anymore. Um, number eight is The Marias with 3,925 minutes. Um, indie dream pop. Um, not like Shoegaze dream pop, but like... Um, but like that indie like synth pop kind of thing sound that was really popular in like the later 2010s early 2020 um i used to like them a lot i still like them they're still good some good music i just don't listen to them as much anymore you know my preferences have changed um nine is weather day with 3919 minutes um, Weather Day is, how do I explain it? Let's see, it's, it's, um, let's see. So fifth wave emo, I guess. Um, so it's kind of like noise rock mixed, mixed with hyper pop, mixed with, I had it the other day. I don't know. Um, just like low fire noise pop, I guess. Um, it's great. I love, I love Weather Day. I was gonna see them live with my partner. They were gonna get the tickets, but they were sold out, and it was gonna be sixty dollars per ticket. And we're not doing that. We're broke, so um, we're not going to that anymore. Maybe next year though. I did see them. Um, in summer of 2022 um and that was awesome the the day after okay the show was great i loved it i had an awesome time after the show horrible day but <laughs> we're not gonna talk about that um yeah i love weather day great great artists great music great everything um after weather day is joji everyone knows joji um i don't really listen to joji anymore i just did like in eighth grade to freshman year. Um, oh my god, Silky just told me to join a Discord server and I can make friends there. Okay, so you know what? Life is looking up. 
Thanks, thanks, so Slifty. I, I don't know if I said Silky or Slifty. It was Slifty. Thank you, Slifty. I appreciate it a lot. I'll join it in a second once I'm done recording this. Um, which is going to be soon because it's already 25 minutes. I'm just going to go through a couple more. Um, yeah. I'll go. I'll kind of like speed through these next few. Everyone knows Joji. Um, 3,879 minutes. Next is Nick Drake with 3,341 minutes. Um, Nick Drake is this, uh, what year? It's like 80s folk. Is it 80s or is it, I don't remember if it's 80s or 60s. Let me check. I think it's 80s. Oh, 70s. 60s through 70s. Um, this old folk artist. Great. Um, I love his music. This is great music. Great calming singer-songwriter type folk rock makes music it's great it's just awesome music love him makes you cry makes you feel things um everyone should listen to nick drake um yeah great artist i love nick drake um number two is hollowed i mean 12 is hollowed with 3233 minutes hollowed was part of that um like 2019 2020 um rise of e-punk um and like in cell core kind of music um so with artists like soda boy um negative xp um hard christ all those kind of bands um artists i mean um hollowed isn't one of the incel bands i don't think um hollowed is great though i love hollowed a lot of those bands weren't really incels it was just some of them and oh so my friend i told you guys earlier um they're just going through some things and he told me the video help so that makes me happy that made me feel good inside thanks um but yeah it's, it's a great great artist i love hollowed um i don't really listen to much of his newer stuff i don't think it's my kind of music really it's good. I, I will say it's good. It's just not my kind of music, you know? Um, number 13 is Maroon 5. For uh, 2,749 minutes. Um, I don't listen to Maroon 5. I only listen... Okay. I listen to their first album every now and then. But I used to listen to them their first album a lot when I was younger. Um, okay, that first album is just... It's gold. It's just a great album. You cannot fault me for li liking it. Um, number 14 is this guy called What Up RG. Same as Andy Mineo, um, another Christian rapper. I don't listen to him anymore at all. Um, not even to like for nostalgia. Yeah. I just it's just not my kind of music. So I don't and I don't have as much nostalgia for him. He was a little newer. Andy Mineo was older, you know, like very much childhood. Um, alongside with Lecrae. He's like a big name in the Christian rap um, scene, I guess. Um, so I used to listen to the both of them a lot. Um, if you give me a second, I'm going to reply to my friend. I don't want to like leave him undelivered. So I'll be right back. My friend is so nice. They said that um, my voice is so soothing, which I don't think is true. I feel like I have an annoying voice sometimes. Um, in person, I like yell a lot. Um, usually when I have more energy, I'm pretty loud. Not right now, because I'm, like, sick. <laughs> so, um, I'm not as energetic. But I do feel a little better after recording that last video. But, yeah. Um, so after What Up RG, or whatever, is, um, Kuko. Um, Kuko is kind of like the Maria's, more... This guy, I don't listen to Kuko anymore. I do listen to some songs sometimes when I'm feeling a little nostalgic for my for eighth grade <laughs> and freshman year. Um, he's good sometimes. I feel like a lot of his music kind of sucks, but it's okay. I don't listen to him anymore. He had a couple good songs. I don't know. Um, next is Rex Orin County, same as uh, um. Same as Kuko, but what uh, Rex Orange County is just kind of more indie, less less synth, more indie. 
Um, I don't even think he uses much synth at all. I think it's just like kind of indie music. Um, yeah. Next is um, negative XP. If you know my channel, you know who negative XP is. I'm not gonna explain that. Um, skipping 18, 18 is very embarrassing. I'm just gonna say it starts with a C. Um, 19 is Dinosaur Jr. With, um, I love Dinosaur Jr. I love Dinosaur Jr. They're so good. Um, they would be higher, but I listen to a lot of their music on YouTube and watch a lot of their live stuff and like stuff like that. <sighs> and number 20 is Bruno Mars. Everyone knows who Bruno Mars is. I used to listen to him a lot growing up, so yeah. Um, I'm not going to go through more. I'm just going to say Plum Tree is already number 30 with 1,592 minutes. I thought it was 2,000. Never mind. Scratch that. Um, number 30. I love Plum Tree. They're so good. I want to get... Okay, because on this app that you use, it has, like, top listeners. I'm the top listener for... Uh, let me see. Um, so I'm the top listener uh, for Soda Boy... Uh, Soda Boy 64, The Stains, um, myself when I still had Spotify, um, my music on Spotify, and uh, Sagwa, which is Soda Boy's band that is like inactive. Um, and I'm like the second highest listener for um, stupid bands. Well, The Carries and The Gobs, I like them too. The other ones are like stuff I don't listen to or like local bands I don't really like. And then I'm third highest for Hollowed. And, yep. Yeah. And so for Plum Tree, I want to get at least top 10. Because top listeners are like... The number one listener is 21,000 minutes. And I'm not even there with Soda Boy. Um, and number two is 12,000. Number three is 11,000. Number four is 7,000. Number five is 5,000. Number six is 4,000. Number three is 3,000. So I can make it to the top 10 probably pretty easily. Uh, and it's not like I'm only listening to them to get to the leaderboard. But it's a fun thing to do because I really like the band. So it's just a fun thing to do. Um, but anyways, hope you guys enjoy the rant of me just saying things. I, I think I like making these kinds of videos and it's easier to make it like while I'm like not showing myself because I'm less self-conscious that way and I can just I can speak a little more freely um but yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video like subscribe watch the whole video please I should have said this at the beginning but um my retention rate is very low most people click off after a minute so I'll say at the beginning of my next video, please watch the whole video because that it's not like I want to be a content creator or like make YouTube videos for a living. I mean, it would be cool. That would be a dream job, but I doubt that would ever happen. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I'll see you guys later. I'm going to post this tomorrow because I reposted a video today. And it'll be a little lame if I post a video right after I posted a video. So I'll post this tomorrow and... Um, Yep. Hope you guys liked it. Um, goodbye.